Deontay Wilder versus Tyson Fury nearly derailed due to U.S. authorities. Stay tuned, coming up next. Hey, this is Cassie, and you're watching Blue Blood Sports TV. Shout out to Blue Blood Sports TV. You're watching Blue Blood Sports TV. Shout out to Blue Blood Sports TV. You're watching Blue Blood Sports TV. Hola, habla Cindy, está viendo Deportes TV. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Blue Blood Sports TV, back at y'all with another one. So, Deontay Wilder versus Tyson Fury, the mega heavyweight showdown between the lineal, undefeated British heavyweight champion and the longest reigning heavyweight champion, the WBC American heavyweight champion, Deontay the Bronze Bomber Wilder, was nearly derailed by the, by the U.S. authorities as Tyson Fury was almost not allowed into the states. Uh, if you uh, if you haven't noticed, or if you haven't known, if you didn't know, should I say, uh, Tyson Fury's dad is not gonna be allowed to uh, enter the states and be ringside for the heavyweight showdown. As Tyson, Tyson Fury states that he knew, and his dad knew that he wasn't gonna be allowed in. Uh, this was an ongoing process for about six years. Uh, they, they, been dealing going back and forth and having meetings and things of that sort with the uh, US you know to get a visa um, his dad was uh, denied the visa you know he was approved the visa but he was uh, as he entered the states and as he landed in New York at JFK you know uh, he was retained and they kept him for about four hours and uh, they asked him questions they strip searched him you know and um, he was nearly the fight was nearly derailed as he was gonna be deported back you know, um, they had to do some research and he never was given a true uh, definition, a true reasoning for why he was retained other than he looked suspicious. And uh, that's just not, that's just not, you know, um, it's just not, it's just not a good thing. You know, it's just, it's just, it's just horrible. You know, he states that, you know, these people could do whatever they want. He said it could be Saturday, they could tell you it's Tuesday and the day is going to be Tuesday. Uh, he said, uh, um, that uh, he was strip searched. He said that he's glad, you know, he was able to push through. Uh, the fight is able to go through. But as he stated, you know, um, they could come up with any reason, man, and uh, and the fight would have nearly been derailed. Not just the fight, you know, but things going on in his personal life. Who knows what he would have went through him and his family, as his father still can't get a visa to come to the states. You know, um, it's just not a good thing. You know, uh, these these things need to be more thoroughly checked. You know, you can't just retain a guy for four hours because he looks suspicious. Really, a six foot nine, 260 pound guy walking through the airport looks suspicious. Pretty sure it's, it's kind of hard for him to, to hide, you know. Um, you know, he stands out. So I don't know why he would look so suspicious. You know, he doesn't look common. He's not, you know, uh, you didn't confuse him with anybody. You know, so, you know, it's just, it's just not a good thing, man. It's just not a good thing. It's just uh, no explanation. Is not um is not a uh, um it's not acceptable. That's just the bottom line. You know you can't tell a guy just because oh well you you look suspicious. So we're gonna retain you for four hours, question you, and strip search you down to the bone. It's ridiculous, man. But I'm glad everything worked out. And uh, a week from today, we get the mega heavyweight showdown between Tyson Fury, the lineal undefeated champion, and Deontay Wilder the longest reigning heavyweight champion, the WBC American champion. So good thing is, is pushed through. His father won't be ringside, so it won't have any effect on him. I know a lot of people was questioning, is it gonna have effect on him that his father won't be ringside, won't be present. But uh, as he stated, it won't have any effect because he already knew uh, prior to, them, to him even attempting to enter the States that they knew his father wasn't gonna be available. So, you know, um, you know, hope everything that works out for him and his father and they can be able to travel through the States, man. But that's all I got. It's your boy Blue, Blue Blood Sports TV. Hate, like, comment, and subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, hit the bell icon to get all new notifications. Follow me on Instagram at Blue Blood Sports TV. All one word. Y'all already know what it is. Shout out to the entire LDBC. Shout out to New Media. Shout out to Black Media Row. It's your boy Blue. Make sure you like and share these videos. Tyson Fury versus Deontay Wilder nearly derailed due to the U.S. authorities. That's all I got for y'all. Peace. The Blue Blood Sport TV, baby, from the Empress. Much love. Bye.